What's going on everybody, it's JRPG Enthusiast here, Shadow Elite, back again with another video. Alrighty guys, so up. Uh, I was wrong. <laughs> Apparently, I was one wrong. Final Fantasy XV is actually coming out in 2016. Let's get Square Enix a round of applause. Oh my god, I can't I can't believe it. September 30th is the day. Hmm, I wonder, should I take off for work for this? <laughs> no, not for Final Fantasy. Maybe a couple years ago, maybe I would have, but not not for Final Fantasy. So yeah, uh, September 30th is coming out, and uh, the demo, they got a new demo, Platinum demo, whatever it's called, I don't even know. It's out on the on uh, on the um, on PSN and Xbox Live. I swear, the only thing that was popping to my head while I played this demo during battle all I felt was Kingdom Hearts that's, that's all I felt the game was was just like Kingdom Hearts I mean at first when it really first opened I felt like Final Fantasy but then as I kept battling it just felt like Kingdom Hearts and as I kept jumping around I'm like what is this a platformer I'm like what the fuck is this so from what I played of the demo again as of this recording I didn't finish it but probably have to upload it I probably will finish it and if I feel differently about it I'll leave a thing in the description maybe a comment section I'll say something but it's largely the same as the demo that came with type 0 HD well not you know you know I'm talking about battle really I'm talking about battle the thing I like about battle now is that there's an enemy there's enemy health so now I can feel like I'm actually doing damage to these to these monsters and shit because in the demo it's like I don't know if I'm killing them like are they almost dead you know that, that, that that's part of the problem I had but um battles largely the same I mean you, you of course you're gonna be sneaking around you're gonna be um platforming a little bit jumping on stuff and whatnot and sneaking around of course as we saw with that um trailer um ultimately where is my hype level regarding final fantasy 15 um it's just um it's there i mean there is uh, it's 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 not even it's not even that exciting anymore this game was announced 10 years ago <laughs> oh my god you know I, <laughs> so much time has passed. Jesus Christ. How many things have happened? You had two Avengers movies. Mass Effect 1, 2, and 3. Okay, the ending of Mass Effect, but you know, whatever. Oh my gosh, so many games have come out. So many franchises have, have, have started and have ended. <laughs> it's like, the hype is just like, it's not there anymore. I mean, I don't really, I, like... I, it's almost not even a day one purchase for me at this point, almost. It, it, it feels like I'm going to buy it day one just so I can play it and maybe get out my early first impressions for you guys when it for, when it comes out. But other than that, I don't even care, honestly. I'm still waiting on that Persona 5. You know, where, where you at? Let's still waiting on Persona 5, but this is about Final Fantasy 15. Um, uh, let's see, um... I, I I don't I don't care for it that much. I honestly don't care for it that much. I remember back when the first trailer came out for this game, way back in 06. And I remember um, talking to people on um, GameSpot. GameSpot had unions back then. If you if you go if you used to go on GameSpot, they had the unions. And I I remember so many people using the Noctis avatar, using um, his swords as you know signatures, sigs, and whatever. And, oh man. It's almost surreal that this game is actually now coming out. And then, from what it looks like, and from the trailers, from what I played in the demos, how can I not be more excited this game for this game? Like my excitement level for the, for this game should be right behind Persona Five, but it's not. It's nowhere in sight, honestly. Um, I'm glad that it's finally coming out so we can finally move on. We can finally get Kingdom Hearts 3 at this point. Maybe ne maybe next year. Now that I'm thinking about it, I may have said like more than two, two years down the line for Kingdom Hearts 3, but maybe, just maybe if Square Enix is following up on the schedule, right? You know, everything's looking good. Maybe, maybe Kingdom Hearts 3 can come out next year. I, I don't know. I have no clue. Maybe we can get both Final Fantasy 7 and Kingdom Hearts 3 next year.
I couldn't do that with a straight face. <laughs> okay. But anyway, guys, let me know in the comments section. If you played the demo, let me know what you think. Where is your hype level for Final Fantasy 15? And what do you want now? Um, oh, pfft. We ain't done yet. What am I talking about? The limited edition. It's a three hundred dollar limited edition. Oh, it's gonna get that. But I'm pretty sure it's sold out by now. Um, it's it, it, yo, it's three hundred dollars. Who has time for that? I mean, unless you like, you know, you are you are a huge YouTuber, or you're you're reporting for a magazine, or it's basically it's your job. <laughs> you get that collector's edition, fine. But me. I, I might just get the standard vanilla, uh, the day one edition, and I'll, and I'll be good. <laughs> I'll just be good with that. Um, <laughs> $300 for a goddamn limited edition. No, collector's edition. I'm sorry. You, you guys are going to go out ahead and collect and uh, correct me there in the comments there. Telling me it's a collector's edition. Oh, my bad. Shit. <laughs> All right, yeah, it's not three hundred dollars. It's two hundred and seventy something, twenty six ninety nine, probably plus tax, probably about two hundred seventy, two hundred seventy seven, or or something like that. But still, this is damn near three hundred dollars. I stuck stick by my three hundred dollar claim. So yeah, guys, this ten year development. Well, who knows if it was actually ten years? Maybe they only actually worked on it for like four or three years. I, I don't know how many times this game was probably actually in development and then they put it down and then they they started working on it again and then they started working on Final Fantasy 13 and then Final Fantasy 13 2 and then they actually started working on it a little bit and then they actually started going full force development on it you know but anyway that that's my that's my little theory about about the game this is like Duke Nukem, oh god, this is gonna be Duke Nukem, isn't it? Oh my god, I shouldn't even be talking about Duke Nukem's not even a JRPG, but you know, all the hype for Duke Nukem, 10 years in development, and then it was all just, just horrible. <laughs> it's not gonna happen, is it? It's not gonna be a terrible game, it's not gonna be Batman v Superman, is it? Okay, that's just completely off topic, but um, again guys, let me know your hype level for this. What are you planning on doing? What are you planning on getting? The limited edition, the standard edition, the day one edition, the, if you can find it on eBay for like $500 by now, <laughs> the um, damn near $300 collector edition. Anyway, guys, that's all I got to say. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.